Hey boys, so today we got a new, uh, well I have a new project I want to showcase to you guys. And as you can see, it's, um, it's this. So, um, in case you're not sure what it is, um, this is my attempt at making a Sukhoi 57. Um, also known as the Felon, apparently. And, uh, yeah. So I tried to make it some... Um, uh, it's sort of scattered design. I'm not sure exactly what it's called because I'm not big brain, obviously. But yeah, um, it's over 1,000 blocks, which is why the frames are just dead. <laughs> um, I'm currently working on. I'm well at the moment. I'm thinking of how to um, how to do the uh, the elevator, not the elevators, the um, the rudders since they're slanted. And I'm using motor lock on this. And I'll show you guys in a bit, but yeah. So, yeah. Pretty exciting. It's my first, like, motor lock build. Um, so, th for the testing, all I have for landing gear is these small wheels. Um, I don't have a rudder, like I said. I was using one for stabilization, um, like, earlier in the process, but... I just got rid of it, because why not? And also, it was only like a really small tail anyways. So, yeah. So, the in... So, for, um... Uh... The propulsion, I'm using... A bunch of hover... Hover drives. Um, I personally use the, uh... The motor version. But, uh, yeah, it's just me. And then, if I press the L key on my keyboard, then you'll actually get the uh, the smoke for the jet boosters. And if you press the P key, the, um, I tried to make damage smoke, as you can see. It's uh, black smoke, sort of. But, also, hang on. First, let me just get into a higher altitude. Let me turn off the smoke real quick. So yeah, it's basically doing constant post stall maneuvers or something like it. <laughs> so it's kind of fun. Mm -hmm. This could be like a cursed version, I guess, because of how uh, how big I made the wings. But yeah, I tried to make it accurate to the um, original. I used uh, reference. Uh, I used pictures for reference. I mean, <laughs> um, it's still quite unstable, as you can see. And, uh, yeah. So I'm using, uh, custom-made elevators, as you can see in the back. And, yeah. Plus, I'm pretty sure I made these, uh, the black parts for the actual jet. For the actual, like, jets. I think I made them, like, way too large. Um, but, I think I'm fine with it for now. So... If I press the uh, left bracket on my keyboard, oh wait, hang on. Um, let's see if it works. Okay, it didn't work. <laughs> um, all right, I'm gonna have to reset. But yeah, and currently I am working on a balance block. Oh uh, well, on balance blocks for balance. Um, so like, uh, the front won't be, uh, lighter than the back, at least not by too much, and yeah. Also, I made it so I can safely eject from this jet, so when I press, um, so first when I press, uh, semicolon, never mind, it's not working at the moment, <laughs> um, yeah, it's still kinda rough, but... Um, if I press uh, the quote key, then the canopy flies off. From there, I can jump, then uh, just parachute out. And I'm safe. And then you can just see the, uh... okay then. <laughs> As you can see, I am perfectly safe due to my teleporting parachute. And my speed was wonderful. And 
the lag is all oh, okay I gotta reset <laughs> okay so um in case I haven't said it yet I because I don't remember anymore um this is my first like main build that's using uh, motor lock so I'm using the cylinder the cylinder method so I have two motor lock stacks one for the uh, top wings and one for the actual control surfaces which are basically just these parts here um, I was afraid that if I uh, covered the bottom here and I put a lot more control surfaces it would basically go down to like 15 or 10 frames a second not that it's already doing that anyways but it would be even worse you know but uh, yeah I also have some here at the front and um yeah yeah let me just double double check these things here all right so if I PvP enabled, and then if I press left bracket, um, you have a bit of damage there <laughs> because I decided to put some uh, TNT, um, the explosive blocks, into the jet boosters for that bit of roleplay damage. I've done that with a few of my other builds, which I'll, um, which I'll show off in um, a showcase. And I'll probably record that right after this. Uh, now that I think about it, but yeah, I put jet boosters in both um, of the jet engines um, for that blue flame. Just try to make it alleys where some sort of flame comes out. Um, and as you can see now, the canopy lift is working, and now I can eject. And then boom. Now let me just check my FPS. And I'm dead again, sweet. Hang on, let's see what my graphics are at. They're almost halfway, so good sign. <laughs> but yeah, that's Okay. That's basically what that's basically all I wanted to show you guys today. So, yeah, hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.